Hello and welcome to this review of Parrot Bay Long Island Iced Tea made with Caribbean rum, gin, vodka, natural flavors, and caramel color. So, mmm. Caribbean rum, gin, vodka. Mm. Parrot Bay. And you say, who is Parrot Bay? It says Parrot Bay Rum Company, New York, New York. And then it says, we love to hear from our customers, Sazerac.com. So it's owned by Sazerac of New Orleans, Louisiana. But uh, it says bottled in New York, New York. I don't think it's bottled in New York. I think that's just an office. But um, I don't know that. Okay. I'll check some other Parrot Bay products, see if I can find out where they're bottled. Now give me the clue. It looks like a Glenmore Owensboro, Kentucky bottle to me. In 1997, Diageo um, started Captain Morgan Parrot Bay flavored drinks. Captain Morgan Parrot Bay. Okay. In 2018, that was sold to Sazerac. All right. They still make a Captain Morgan Long Island iced tea, but I was looking at the ingredients and it's somewhat different. Okay, this has the caramel because they're using caramel color. So it gives it that tea-like uh, appearance. What are the natural flavors? Probably lemon extract, something like that. Uh, iced tea or tea. Just tea, sugar, of course. Let's go. It smells like iced tea. Let's go with the taste. 200 milliliter bottle is $2.79 at Cheap Smokes on United States Highway 61 northbound. Just a few blocks south of the intersection with Louisiana Highway 3188. All right. Um, Definitely they are adding lemon, lemon extract. Get the liquor flavor, just not, oh, I can taste the gym, the gym, the gym dandy. I can taste the gin, I can taste the rum, I can taste the vodka. No, you just can tell it's got liquor, 15%. Put it in the fridge for a few days and I had it in the freezer for about 20 minutes. Um, it's got bitterness and I don't know if that bitterness is coming from the liquor admixture or from the tea. And I, I get the impression that's more from tea leaves like bitter. Now, one good thing about this, it's not overly sweetened. They didn't go hog wild crazy with sh sugar sweetness, okay? Um, which is nice. The Firefly um, whatever they call it, Southern Sweet Tea or whatever, that was super sugary. Woof. Well, that's the way they were supposed to be. And Firefly is bottled is produced by Sazerac for Firefly for their outside of South Carolina sales. So I know that's in Owensboro, Kentucky. But this is outright owned by Saz the Sazerac company. Yeah, it's really nice uh, for uh, uh, if you want a Long Island iced tea drink. Parrot Bay, I see them around. Uh, there's a lot of Parrot Bay products. Uh, this one's not listed on the website, so I didn't put a, a, a link. But if you look up Sazerac.com, Sazerac, S-A-Z-E-R-A-C, Sazerac.com, they talk about Parrot Bay in, uh, also under their liqueur section, and they also have a link to the website. And they have coconut rum and so forth. I don't think there's any unflavored rum. They don't really do a gold in a silver because really that's not their focus it's on these flavored 
extremely popular flavored liqueurs. Well, liqueur is flavor, but you know what I'm saying, the pre-mix. So, why they don't list it, I couldn't tell you. But anyway, give it one more sip, and then I'll score it. So, a dollar forty for a hundred milliliters. Seventy cents for fifty milliliters. That's typical. That's a typical airplane bottle sample size. So I just got four times that. Um, yeah, it's like typical Sazerac. It's either B or A. So I'm gonna go with A minus here. Ninety out of one hundred. Nine point zero out of ten. It's an excellent product to an extent. I can't dog it on its style because that is the style. I mean. To say, oh, look here, they're all terrible. You know, it doesn't make any sense. Don't drink them. You don't like to stop. So, um, Lazy Le Bon Ton Relate, a 90. And I'm going to end this review by saying, y'all, in this case, go to New Orleans and tour the Sazerac house. And they might have Long Island iced tea being sampled that very day.